that worked with me, with mm-hmm. Dennis Leary, when I mentioned Adam's name. Yeah, 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 yeah. Blew me off. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, really? Water? Yeah. Fuck him. This your water? <laughs> him. Fucking Leary. Is this your water? Fucking talentless cunt. Hate him. Wow, you're not <laughs> a big Dennis Leary no, fan? I, wait, what's this about? No, we can make a headline mind. today. Never, never mind. mind. I might want to be in Rescue let's, Me. Let's make a little <laughs> Google alert today. I don't know where that came from. Let's go for a Google <laughs> alert. It's our new bit. Let's go for the Google alert. Why uh-huh. do you hate? Why do you hate Dennis Leary? You guys ever fight? What? Did you ever have an argument? No, with him? it's just funny because last time I saw him, we had a nice conversation. He's oh. always, I'm always nice to him in public. Stole a bit from me years ago. That's oh, all. did he? Yeah, that's all. Oh, that, that's a biggie, though, Louis. What yeah. bit? Because I uh, used to listen to the early uh, Dennis mm-hmm. Leary stuff, and uh-huh. I thought he was a genius. Uh, yeah. And now I have to think you're the genius. Well, what bit was it? <laughs> oh, was, was it off his first album? I don't know. I never heard his album. Mm-hmm. But please, of course you have. Couldn't be oh, bothered. I haven't? Cool. <laughs> <laughs> like in Demi. I was gonna say, uh, like you would take me to task. Oh, yeah, the God. bullshit. You like it? I was gonna say, of course you have. We're, that's where you got your oh, act. Weird. From. I've never said anything about it, and I don't know why that just made me. Because oh, you know why? Because he was shitty to you. That makes he, me mad. He did. He fucking totally was a I douche. I don't care that he skates what? and has whatever, buddy. The fact that he was a douche <clears> to you just. We've settled. Mad. We've since settled it. First time I've said anything about him. He's a friend of the show. It was up in Boston. Uh, I was there with my friend Adam Ferrara, who was in uh, the job, the show, the job with him. And uh, uh, Adam was like, yeah, I'll take you up and meet uh, Dennis. Uh, mm-hmm. So I go upstairs. We're hanging out, all hanging out, all my friends. Everybody's hanging around. The bar's kind of full. Dennis is up there getting a drink. I decide not to wait for Adam. I can do this myself. I'll walk up to Dennis Leary, say, hey, Dennis, I'm a friend of Adam Ferrara. Shake his hand and start talking, and uh, that'll be that. So I walk up to the bar. I go, hi, Dennis. I'm a friend of uh, Adam Ferrara. Name's Anthony. He goes, doesn't even look at me. He goes, yeah. how you doing? And then turns his back to me. He wasn't yeah. talking to anybody. Yeah. He wasn't busy. He just yeah. went, how you doing? Uh, turned nice. his back to me. And I was just like, and so I walk away slowly. And it was so bad that all my friends and all, everybody, all workers, said, everybody, we were all couldn't, couldn't even laugh at me for it. They, oh, no, I, that's I looked, bad. I got a quick enough look to see them turn away and not look at me. That's bad. Were you embarrassed? Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Dude, and, and forgot the uh, part where Dennis Leary actually kind of did the backwards handshake. Oh, looking my at like, God. Yeah, yeah, he just yeah, goes, yeah, yeah, how you doing? And reaches out oh his hand like, yeah, God. yeah. And I was like, oh, and all I was thinking is, I should have waited for Adam. <clears throat> you, you, but you felt stupid? Dude, hey. so stupid. Hey. I felt like such a douche, and everyone was embarrassed for right. me, which hurt even <laughs> I'm more. I'm so happy that Adam. All right, well, <laughs> I knew you'd wait, love wait, wait. I, yeah, I, 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 we can't <laughs> let Louie off the hook here. Well, so let me, no? tell, you, cause let me tell you what happened. I'll tell you, the, look, I, I have to tell you everything for it to, to be fair. Uh-oh. Because, uh, well, when I was a young fella starting in Boston, mm-hmm. I guess I was like 19 or 20. 19. And I was doing my signature bit, the bit I closed with, was a bit about uh, if you were an asshole and you knew it and how cool it would be to just say, I'm an asshole and just let yourself have that life, that your life would be better. Like you're driving, mm-hmm. you go, hey, should I cut that guy off? Yeah, I'm an asshole. Why not? <laughs> you know, uh, park in a handicapped space. Only an asshole would do that. Oh, uh, fuck, fuck it. I'll do it. I'm an asshole. That's me. And they, uh, you said they should have like... A picture of an asshole instead of a wheelchair and just make those the asshole spaces and the whole bit. Anyway, so one night i um, doing a show at a place called Played Against Sam's in Boston. And Dennis is the host of the show. He was a huge star in Boston at the time and uh, on the comedy circuit. And he went on after me. He was always nice to me, by the way. Put me on the mm. shows when I wasn't yeah. on, on them. Should be. Gave me guest spots. And then that night he went on after me. Uh, after I'd done the asshole bit and like went, that's really funny and like <clears throat> remarked on it and expounded on it. Like, yeah, like in that, like I'll do this because I'm an asshole and I'll do that because like, I'm an asshole. Like he just started. He actually riff- started riffing on Riffing it. on my bit, but acknowledging that he just watched me do it. Which, yeah. Which is, I think is okay. And oh, then boy. like, um, I don't know, a month later or something, I'm downstairs at Sam's. I just come walk in and he's doing, <laughs> he's just doing the bit. Just started, he just started doing it. And I was young and just started out, and I was like, well, he's huge. Wow, I'm flattered. What do I do? <laughs> well, and I remember thinking and to angry. myself, I remember thinking to myself, well, <clears throat> it's weird that he would steal. It's too bad that he has to. I'm tired of the bit myself. I feel I felt like I'd outgrown it, and so I just thought, I think I'd just let it go, and I did. And, uh, yeah, so then it became a, a 
this one I think you're about to play. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Dude. People in just, handicapped spaces and handicapped. Yeah, get that line, too. But you do realize. Hi, Louie. Uh, uh, yeah. He, the song's he, made a huge amount of money, too. Yeah, he more than stole a bit from you. Yeah, that's he made his, it a number that's one That's his single. signature fucking, like, yeah. thing. So, yeah. That, that was a video on MTV. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's how big that bit <laughs> was for him. Oh, I it wasn't like a throwaway little bit you did. No, this sir. was like, this is what he's known for. Yeah, it was a career-making bit. <laughs> he, he's still, <laughs> career he still uh, sings this song every every time yes. he performs. Well, as a matter of fact, the last time, uh, <laughs> uh, during two years ago at the New York Comedy Festival. He closed with this. He was, uh, he, and I was on the show. <laughs> oh, Actually, my I think God. He did, I think he did it and then brought me on. And I just don't, oh. I don't identify with it anymore. And, and the other thing, the pieces that are important to tell, is that years later I'm living in New York City. I run into Dennis on the set of a movie he's doing, and he go, he says, God, you're always so funny. What are you doing with yourself? And at the time I was trying to finance an uh, independent feature I was making, and he gave me uh, several thousand dollars and helped me find it. He just basically was, gave me money. Oh, that was, okay. that was guilt money. Yeah. yeah, which I never really even thought of that, but I guess that's true. And I, I mean, he gave, and, and he so he invested in it. Guilty and and I, when I run into Dennis, we say hi to each other. And uh, was he counting out the money, going? <laughs> <laughs> and uh and then yeah and then when i did his show on avery fisher hall and he and he played this song and brought me on and i remember thinking oh, that's silly that's a silly moment in my life but i just don't i don't know it's it's weird i don't uh i've never never said anything and it's just funny because i there's this other poor fucking idiot that's been <laughs> accused for three years now of stealing shit from me and I've never said a word about that because I'm, I'm ambivalent about it but this is a guy who I completely watched steal my bit and make money off of it and I've never done a fucking thing. You know what the funny thing is though, there's another story wow. you told too where Louis walked in on his danger fields, remember that? And fucking Roddy was there and he goes, how you doing? And you're like, I don't think like I get no respect. And Roddy went, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I understand but, how you feel, huh? Yeah. You know. I I mean, I've always had kind of a perspective about people that steal material that I feel like they're, I don't know, it feels like what they do to themselves is probably a lot worse than anything. I mean, what am I going to do about it? I, yeah. I, I just kind of keep, continue living my life, uh, you know, making more things. But but that is, the dentist thing That's is a, a weird one. one. And I guess since That's he gave one. me money for my movie and he was always generally kind to me, I always felt like, well, I'd be a hypocrite to say something about it. Yeah. Well, and never... for some reason, when I heard Anthony say that he was rude when he that he's rude to you, it he just, was it just rude lit, to me the lit, first time. Lit me off, made me mad. But then we've had him on the show many, many times, and uh, right. So you and know, he it's does a, your bits very well. Uh, and uh, he, <laughs> but Louis is yeah. a fucking shocking guy. my buddy. So. Yeah. Been a shocking guy since he was a little kid. Like when you said you were a little kid. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and he told me this. He was a boy. He would always curse. Uh -huh. well, what do you say? Yeah. They went one time to see yeah. George Carlin, uh -huh. and they introduced him to young Louis, and, and yeah. Louis was trying to be shocking, uh -huh. and he was like, "Shit, piss fuck, cunt." Like a <laughs> <laughs> he goes, how many words are that? Seven? Seven. Was that seven curses you just and, 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 laid out? He lied. And they said, where'd you hear that? He went, on television. <laughs> That's impossible. <laughs> it's like, uh, I'm like the, the Forrest Gump of uh, <laughs> yes, comedy. comedy. Yes. Louis, it continues today. Uh, Stephen S. from Bayshore writes, this just in. Dennis's ex-wife let his dog out and got hit by a car. So he's oh, going oh, to uh, oh, Holy shit, Stephen S., are you crazy? Nice. <laughs> oh, my goodness. He cried over that dog and i just get oh let's all suck louis dick oh really <laughs> who said that, that? let's yeah <laughs> really Everybody yeah. Somebody's let's mad do at me. it i still owe him from lucky yeah, louis so let's get going I'm happy to suck yeah Ooh, i guess uh, god that sounded oh that was gay. from dennis l i'm sorry oh He's a little, wow. yeah. <laughs> hey, that's a big like story the right there that's well, a bit, I, that's a google alert right there for I yourself am. I don't, no. I don't like it. I don't like uh, the comedy bloggers are gonna run with that one, my oh, friend. Oh, sir, I don't like it. Don't like being associated with that kind of shit, even from a. Victim. Why would you be? I mean, you fucking had that incident. Remember that time you said you were driving <laughs> with a moose on the fender, and there's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Woody Al, what's wrong with you? <laughs> so obscure. I have but to say, but it was an elk. It actually, from. it wasn't a. Yeah. it wasn't a moose. It was an elk. <laughs> the moose bit. Why is the moose bit so uh, brilliant in, in comedy circles? It, because it was I done shot a moose in once, the 60s. And then I fucked my daughter. <laughs> yes. <laughs> she looked like the girl running with Agent Orange on her. <laughs> and, <laughs> Louis, uh, because Woody Allen, is, I think he's the greatest joke writer ever. There's never been a guy who wrote fucking... Yeah, the bits good. were so involved, and they always yeah. paid off, and they were done in the early 60s, and they're still, Very by and large, original... Ideas. It's amazing yep. how fucking great he was. Mm -hmm. it's, 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 it's annoying. Alive. 
way What's you make that? it sound. It's amazing how great he, he was. was. God rest his pedophile yeah. soul. Why wouldn't do... a guy like that, like for a goof, go out and start doing stand-up? I think again? he was afraid of doing it. He was. He said it was always made oh, him nauseous. One of the guys that got scared. Yeah, but the, mm. the idea of fucking. Got scared. Uh, I, I shot a moose and then where he took it. it the fucking great. moose and the Solomons. Oh, so good. I'm <laughs> driving with two Jewish people on my fence. It's like annoying how good it is. No. Yeah. He's just a funny dude. What did he do for Diane Keaton recently? It was like last year or two years ago. They quoted him in the paper. And a roast or, or some tribute to her. He was roasting her a little bit. Mm -hmm. And he said uh, she's uh, really, uh, what do you say? She's really attractive, but not in the classical sense. And by classical sense, I mean visually appealing. It's <laughs> <laughs> just, <he's> just funny. <laughs> he's just, it was something along those lines. <laughs> but he's I just fucking a funny bastard. He is funny there. as hell. Yeah. Oh, it makes me sick. I'm talking about my dick and my dumb erections, and he just, Ooh, he's that's, just the best. Have we been in, um... That amazes me that that doesn't bother you that much. I don't know why. I don't know. I don't that's know. Because that's a biggie. Yeah. Have we been I in, I think uh, it's because I'm a guilty person. I I'll feel like I'm guilty myself. Third time, maybe. Sorry, uh, go ahead. Uh, no, I'm go kidding. Ahead. I, I was, yeah. I was, no, right I was actually...